Hi everybody, and welcome back. Today we're going to continue talking about ostinatos and look at different types of ostinatos we could use. You'll remember from last time that an ostinato is a pattern that repeats in a piece of music. Sometimes ostinatos are melodic, meaning they have specific notes or pitches to them, and sometimes ostinatos can be rhythmic, having percussion sounds to them. Let's take a look at two different examples. Melodic ostinato. Dim 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 dim. I wish I was an apple hanging on a tree, and every time Miss Cindy passed, she'd take a bite of me. Rhythmic ostinato. I wish I was an apple hanging on a tree, and every time Miss Cindy passed, she'd take a bite of me. So you could hear in those two clips that there were two different ostinatos running underneath the same song, the folk song Cindy. The first time, it was an ostinato that went doom, 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 doom. And then the second time, it was a percussive rhythm, something I was clapping, but there was no pitch to that. So melodies could be something like we heard in the last video, like this. Or we saw other examples of rhythmic ostinatos, like this. Ostinatos, both melodic and rhythmic, are found all over music. And you can take music that you like and add your own ostinato to it. So take a favorite song of yours, see if you can get some percussion instruments you find around your house, or even just clap and create some kind of rhythmic ostinato that matches with the music. Or turn on the radio, see if some of the songs that you like actually have ostinatos in there underneath the music that you didn't even notice before. They're all over the place. Have fun checking this out and creating some of your own ostinatos. If you come up with some good ones, maybe have some of your family members help you out. I'd love to hear them. You can send me a video. Take care, everybody. Bye.